friends, Amy Love here, and I'm coming on today to share with you this journal signature that I created. It's just one signature, but I thought I would show you how I put it together. I already showed you some of the things I created for it in earlier videos, but I tied the signature together with this beautiful ribbon. I just love it so much. And the digital that I used uh, to create this signature is Pink Parfait Cafe from Ooh La La Vintage Treasures. And I will, of course, put a link below to Doreen's Etsy store. And I will put a link to the Pink Parfait kits. I just love them so much. <clears throat> so the envelope that I decorated, and I'll put a link to that video up here in the iCards if you missed it. Um, I showed you how I decorated it. So that's the thing that's on the top. So when you open it up, it has the pocket with the beautiful journaling cards from the kit. Just love. And they have the stickles and the, the gold leafing pin that I used all up now. And I have to get a new one because I love it so much. And those just slip right here in this pocket. I made these paper clips on another video. I think it was last month or the month before even. And so I tucked that right here. So that just slips on right there. And then I used this beautiful piece from the kit to make a belly band. And then I just stuck this envelope in there. And I'm going to put a personal note in there to the recipient. So that goes there. And then when you flip this over, this, isn't this beautiful? I just love this kit so much. This comes out so you can journal on all the places. And it's just tied together with this piece of fabric. And this has some be beautiful embellishments on it. Just gorgeous. And inside the pocket, I just made a big journaling card with one of the beautiful images from the kit and I just sewed around the edge and did a little stenciling that I don't think you can really see because of my camera and the sunshine but there's a little stenciling on there but still you could journal on there so I have that that goes right in the envelope just so pretty and so then when you open it up I this beautiful dyed uh, paper I got from my friend Marie and I'll put a link to uh, Marie's Etsy below too. That's where I got the beautiful dyed papers. And then I made this scrappy pad that I just clipped on with this adorable, look, these are so cute, y'all. I got these on Amazon and they are so stinking cute. I love them so much. So there's a bunch of them in this uh, little signature because they're just so stinking cute. So that's just clipping that on right now, but I actually have it clip, uh, over the page. So the, the scrappy pads on this side and then um, here's the back of the scrappy pad which is another uh, tuck spot or you could clip something into the beautiful clip and another beautiful image. Isn't that so pretty? It's just so pretty. And of course this beautiful page right here is uh, one of the papers from the kit. Just gorgeous. I did a little more stenciling on this page, but these are two great journaling pages. And then this is just a beautiful page from the kit. Just beautiful to journal on. It didn't need anything, so I didn't do anything to it. It's just beautiful. And then on the back of the digitals, I just did a little stenciling really lightly so you could still journal. So on this dyed dictionary page, I have another one of these beautiful clips holding on a gorgeous postcard from Doreen's kit that is stickled and has the gold leafing around the edges. Love, love, love. So cute. I did do some stenciling here too with some gesso. And then here's another journaling page, another page that I got actually from Marie. Uh, some German book paper, I'm pretty sure, and some embossed papers. Another beautiful paper from the kit. 
have I mentioned this is my favorite kit and you can see why it's just beautiful and then on this side I made another belly band with this beautiful piece look at how beautiful that is and I did a little gold leafing with my pin on there just gorgeous and then in the belly band I have an index card that has been uh, dyed and then I stenciled with gesso on there and then I stenciled some on this page too just so absolutely pretty and this beautiful um, French paper that's been heavily dyed <coughs> and then um, more stenciling and then this beautiful page look at that I mean these are just gorgeous this kid is gorgeous Doreen but you know how I feel about that already <laughs> So I used another one of these adorable paper clips to clip this card onto the uh, embossed paper. It's so cute. And then you could, of course, journal right on the back of that. Love, love. So cute. And then here's another card from the kit just clipped on with one of those paper clips. So sweet, right? So cute. Lots of room to journal because, in case my the friend who's getting it, in case they want to journal in it, they certainly can. Look at this page. Oh, oh this kid is beautiful. Just beautiful. And then here is another um, card postcard from the kit with a little lace tab and then this is a removable uh, paper clip so here's the card and here's the adorable little clip that I created to go on there Let me get that in there and then I just have that clipped right onto the page so I get back on there nicely yes so cute Except I think I had it over here so that it wouldn't cover up the beautiful paper. Because look at how gorgeous. It's just gorgeous. So that is my little Pink Parfait Cafe signature. And of course I sewed it all together so it could just be tied into a journal. And I think it's so sweet so please leave me a comment and let me know what you think and don't forget to give me a thumbs up and of course you will find a link to Doreen's Etsy store below and to all the other designers on the team they all make them beautiful beautiful incredible things and, and and are always inspiring me so be sure you go and check them out and I hope you're all having a great day see you next time bye